workout. Today we're working on arms. Now arms is one of my favorite body parts to work on because in just a few weeks, you can get some nice sexy arms. All you're gonna need for this workout is two pound dumbbells, but before we begin, we're gonna start with the warm up. We're gonna start with swimmers. Just to get the blood flowing, just sway your left and right arm up and down, just like you're swimming. Inhale and exhale. Take a deep breath. And then we're gonna go to boxers. Okay, just move left and right. We're also warming up the waist, the legs. Because even though you're working out the arms, you really use up all the other body parts. Just left and right, boxers. And then arm swings to the back. Get your chest open. And then we're gonna go into a very minimal stretch. Get your arms like this. And then bend to the right. You can feel it already, feeling good already. And bend to the left. Okay, now we're gonna begin. All you're gonna need for this workout is two pound dumbbells. I always have some dumbbells where I am, wherever I go. You can even actually do this in your car. You can do this in your bathroom before you go to work. You can do it everywhere. Everybody has 10 minutes, so stay with me. Okay, I'm gonna take you through 12 exercises. Each exercise is gonna last for only 20 seconds. So for sure you can do 20 seconds. We're gonna start with dumbbell presses, okay? Get your dumbbells in your palms and go up. There. Close it in and push it up. Okay, follow with me. This exercise you're working on the biceps, the triceps, and the shoulder area. We're gonna work out the entire arm. Okay, next we're gonna go into arm circles. Dumbbells on the sides and just circle them. Circle them. Okay, you should be feeling this on the top of your arm, also in the biceps. Okay, just 20 seconds. If you feel the burn, just stay right there. And then drop your arms for a bit, rest. Next exercise, arm circles to the front, but this time go the other way. So you work the other part of the arm. This is a beautiful exercise. You can even do this in the car. You can do this everywhere you go. Are you feeling it? I'm feeling it. You're on your way to nice arms. All right, now we're gonna move on to the up and down swings. Still working on the top of your arm. And you're gonna go up, up and down. Feel it, still working on the top of the arm. If you get tired, what I do is I turn to the right so I get a different view. Working the arms here, just 20 seconds. And then one of my favorite exercises I call them uppercut punches. They're very good for the biceps. So you go uppercut with the left and right. So make sure when you do this exercise that you're also moving your legs and you're also working your abs actually. But we're focusing on the biceps. All right, now we're gonna move on to the tricep area. Still hold your dumbbells right on top and you're gonna go alternate tricep lifts. Inhale, take a deep breath, keep your abs in. Working on that tricep that oftentimes has a lot of fat stored. I work a lot on my tricep because it's one of my weak areas. Okay, still working on the tricep. You're gonna go dumbbell presses, alternate. So you bend over, focusing on your tricep. There you go. For just 20 seconds. You can stay there if you feel it. Just remember you're on your way to nice one. Nine. Two more seconds. All right. Now we're going to go into one of my favorite exercises as well. It's called a fast arm swing. So still holding your dumbbells, you do a running motion but you go as far front as you can and as far back. Getting tired, move one way. So just as fast as you can, you're working the whole arm here. And move the other way. Five seconds more. 
Very good. You've done eight exercises. And just for a break, I'm gonna do some jumping jacks. So come on, jumping jacks. Just 15 of them. Everybody can do jumping jacks. You learned this as a kid. Also gives your arms a little bit of a rest. Okay, so far so good. To continue with the arms workout, we're gonna go down on the floor for some arm push-ups. Now, don't get intimidated by push-ups. You can do this with your knees on the ground. So this time, to work on the biceps, you're gonna point your hands going outside, okay? And then you go down. So by doing this, you are focusing on the biceps. 20 seconds, 10 more seconds, go as low as you can, if you get tired, take a break, and then go down again, and one, okay, so those are for the biceps, and now we're going to move on to the triceps, still in the push-up position, but you're just going to switch the position of your arms a bit, closer to your body, elbows are close, and then go down. So by doing it this way, you are focusing on the tricep. If you're strong enough, you can do it with a full push-up position. But if not, you can just stay down on your knees. Two more exercises. Well, I can feel that on my tricep. Okay, very good. Now you're gonna stand up again, take your dumbbells, and then we're gonna do jabs. This is a very good exercise that can really work the entire arm. Okay, you just go left and right jabs. Do it until you feel you're burning. This time we're only doing it 20 seconds. You get tired. What I like to do is go to the other side. I get a different view. Somehow I get more energy. Oh, okay, last exercise. This is one of the most effective arm exercises you take your dumbbells right in front of you and you just twist it this way and this way so when you go this way it works this bicep this way Woo. last one stay there and go to the other side that gives you a pause working it working it working it very good okay now we're gonna cool down with a few stretches, uh, you can feel that in your arms. But if you have more time, you can play the tape again and do that set over. If not, you can go into the stretch. Okay, we're gonna stretch the right tricep this way, that way. Ooh, I can feel my heart rate going. And then this way, stretching the shoulder. There. Again, stretch right this way, and you're done. Beautiful workout, do that four times a week. You can start with three times a week, as I mentioned earlier. You can do this whole routine. Again, you can do it in the morning, and then in the evening. Of course, you have to combine it with healthy eating, and a little bit of cardio workout, and you're on your way to beautiful arms. See you on our next Day and Fit Workout. Right after my workout, my favorite post-workout drink, Easy Famac Wheatgrass. Very easy, you just open the sachet, put it in water, mix it up. It's loaded with vitamins, minerals, enzymes, amino acids, chlorophyll, everything that you need to cleanse, alkalize, and nourish your body. Cold water. Love my wheatgrass. Thank you very much to our new friends in Alabang, the Akasha Hotel, for this wonderful venue, a place to go to in Alabang.